Lincoln Square Restaurant and Bakery has closed its doors for good. WGN's Judy Wang takes us to Cafe Sel Marie's last day. In line, one last time. Just a, the heart of Lincoln Square. It's such an anchor institution, and we're really sad to see it go. One last brunch, one last dessert order, one last cup to go. I discovered this place like at the beginning of this year, and I fell in love. And since then, I'm coming by like every weekend. Best wishes. One last hello to the owner who is saying farewell after 41 years. I feel in incredibly, immensely honored and humbled and uh, just grateful and, and so lucky. Berge Kobayashi and her neighbor, Jeannie used a witness were young mothers when they met. Both loved to bake. Kids were little and there were no Starbucks. There was no Starbucks yet or no cafes for young moms to go to be coffee clutched at each other's homes. They decided to combine their talents and open Cafe Sel Marie in 1983 to sell their coffee and pastries. Sel Marie was a combination of their middle names. Once we made the decision to go into business, to, to do this, to open up a pastry shop together, we just went through all the motions and we did what we had to do and we never looked back. Can I help you? Since then, the cafe has employed thousands of people who have contributed their own recipes. Saturday morning, regulars packed the Lincoln Avenue staple to show their gratitude and to wish Kobayashi a happy retirement as she begins her next great adventure. I try to think about everyone, my parents, all the people whose shoulders I stand on, and there are many. I'm just torn between joy and a little bit of sorrow, but uh, I'm looking forward to my next chapter and I feel very satisfied and contented that I did something, I accomplished something, and now I finished. Thank you. In Lincoln Square, Judy Wang, WGN News.